unearthed a really big mystery at Cape Coral High School. Something very unusual turned up in a classroom over summer vacation, and the Lee County Sheriff's Office is now investigating this disturbing discovery. Foreign reporter investigator Dave Colbert uncovered this strange story, and he shares what he's been able to confirm so far. Just before school started back last month at Cape Coral High School, a teacher found inside a cabinet, wrapped inside a brown paper bag, a mason jar, which contained a four-month-old human fetus. We should caution you that some of this material may be disturbing to some people. When teacher Robert Snyder came back from summer break on August 7th and entered his classroom where he teaches early childhood services, he opened up a cabinet and according to incident reports with the Lee County Sheriff's Office and the District Medical Examiner's Office, he found a human specimen in a mason jar filled with formalin inside a brown paper bag. It says it had been 16 to 19 weeks since conception and that it is a white female. It goes on to say the body is well preserved with all its features like eyes, ears, nose, mouth, feet and toes all normal. Measurements were taken and say that it's eight inches long and still attached to it is an umbilical cord eight and a half inches long. Questions, how did it get here? Who put it here? When over the summer did they put it here and why? The medical examiner's report says it had not been present at the close of school before summer. No documentation could be located and no teachers or the principal were aware of where it had come from. The report also said there was no evidence of trauma. The Lee County Sheriff's Office is still investigating and due to that, neither the school nor the school district would comment on this issue. Dave Colbert, Fox 4 in your corner.